Well, howdy, friends. Brian Fleshig, a matter of Outfitters in the Midwest Fly Fishing Schools, and here we are, a holiday season 2019. And as promised, we're going to be coming at you with a couple episodes each week for holiday gift ideas. We really appreciate the request for this. Uh, we really appreciate your willingness to support a small, family-owned specialty business like ours. So today, I'm going to get started with 10 gift ideas for the angler in your life. So let's jump right in today. I just came up with some ideas here that have kind of popped in my mind. And as I said, stay tuned. We've got a lot more of this coming at you. Um, but first of all, I've got some kind of stocking stuffer ideas. Number one. You know, fishing pliers have traditionally always been a great gift idea. And many of you know uh, that I am a big fan of the Manly pliers. Uh, my Manly 5-inch super pliers have been on my belt for many years, but you may have seen my recent review of the Gripper Nipper, which is kind of my new favorite tool. It's a little more trouty sized, a little more streamlined nose on it, has a fantastic cutter on it that'll cut anything down to say 6X or 7X tip. It pretty amazing. And the Manly pliers, certainly stocking stuff are capable and they're not outrageously expensive. You're looking at $59.99 on the Nipper Grippers and $49.95 on the five inch super pliers. But if that's not good enough and you want to shoot for the fence, or aim for the fence. Of course, probably the best fishing pliers ever developed, the Hatch Tempest pliers. Uh, there's two different sizes of these. This is the big one, which I prefer, and I forget how much they are. I probably forget how much they are for a reason because they are very expensive. Uh, but if you're looking for uh, a gift for somebody that has everything and they might not spend this kind of money on their own, the Hatch uh, I think they're called the Nomad and the Tempest pliers. Um, they are expensive, come with a leather sheath, amazing cutter, amazing machining, and anodized finish. So check those out, um, the Hatch Nomad and Tempest pliers. Number two, of course fly boxes are traditionally a, a classic gift item, again kind of a stocking stuffer. Fly anglers can never have enough fly boxes. Uh, this is one I've shown you before, the Teton Streamer Vault. It says right there, you can hit it with a hammer in case you get mad at it. Um, but <clears throat> perfect size for today's modern day streamers, some bass bugs, smallmouth box, um, really a great option. But you can go to madriveroutfitters.com and of course we have hundreds and hundreds of different options in fly boxes that make for great gift items. Number three. Uh, we just got these new coffee mugs. We've got the Mad River Outfitters logo on the inside, so as you're taking a sip, you can be reminded about how awesome Mad River Outfitters is. And number four, the silicone fly drying patch. Uh, you can stick this thing virtually anywhere, peel off the backing, stick it to your boat, to your cooler, to um, the back of your truck, and you can put flies in here to let them dry before you put them away in the fly box. I think that's $12.95, no big deal. Number five, kind of a cool little gadget here. It's a little bit different than your average zinger, uh, but this is called the uh, Mini Mag Magnetic Tool Keeper, and it's pretty cool. Uh, you can use this for a variety of different things. I see a lot of people holding boga grips with them. You can put pliers on here. You can put, you can hang, anything you can hang, you can hang on this. Uh, the Mini Mag Magnetic Tool Keeper comes with this lanyard, not outrageously expensive at $11.99. Uh, perfect stocking stuffer. Number six, nippers make a great gift and there's a lot of high-end nippers on the market. And of course, you've heard us talk about the Able nippers, uh, but we did just get three new hand-painted versions in here. And if you're looking for just an absolutely premium, unique gift, the Able Nippers, which you've heard us talk about before, they're now available in the American Flag hand-painted, the Brown Trout hand-painted, and we have the Rainbow Trout hand-painted. These things are absolutely exquisite. They're beautiful. It's a totally unique and expensive gift item. I think they come in at 185 
whereas the standards are maybe 85 and then the color is 105. But if you're looking for a really premium gift that the angler might not buy for themselves and then uh, just getting the unique hand painted version in there makes it kind of special. Seven, um, books. Uh, we're old fashioned around here and we still love to read books. We love to sell books. We have an extensive library here at Matter for Outfitters, but this is kind of a new book. It's by our good friends, Dave and Emily Whitlock, and it's called Trout, Char, and Salmon, and the Classic Flies That Catch Them. Tips, tactics, and advice on taking our favorite game fish. And I tell you, friends, this is an absolutely beautiful coffee table kind of book that separates all the different trout, char and salmon of course with dave whitlock's absolutely beautiful beautiful illustrations and paintings this is a really a book to be cherished and it's only 24.99 and a hardcover the current stock that we have in the shop is autographed by dave and emily so a really really special coffee table kind of book that you are going to want to read or the angler that you're buying for is going to want to read so check that out uh, of course on our website number eight my favorite i had to include this not necessarily for an angler um, but this is uh, first of all a new brand for us here at mad river outfitters called sherpa and sherpa is all made in nepal by nepali people um, the, a lot of the proceeds go to benefit the people of Nepal and I'm telling you it's some of the best outdoor gear that we've ever seen. I'm really excited to have it. But this is my favorite piece of the season. It's called the, oh and I, I forgot my glasses. Can you believe that? No. Oh no. I'll try to read it anyway. It's called the uh, Kirtipur, K-I-R-T-I-P-U-R. And I'm telling you, friends, this thing is absolutely amazing. Um, it's uh, wool on the outside. It does have some Prima Loft insulation in it. It's got a fleecy lining. It's got the sheep fleece lining in the hood and the collar. Uh, the lining goes all the way down through the sleeves. This is absolutely one of the best sweaters I've ever seen in my life. Again, if you're searching on our website, just look up Serp Sherpa, excuse me, in the brands drop down your menu or check out Kirtipur, K-I-R-T-I-P-U-R sweater. Um, this thing is absolutely amazing, $299.95. It's pricey, but well worth it. And I guarantee you, whoever you buy it for is gonna have it for years and probably pass it down through generations. Nine! We just got these the other day. The Fish Pond Thunderhead series has really become synonymous with ballistic, uh, many times submersible products. And Fish Pond has just brought out the new Thunderhead rod and reel case. And I'm telling you again, for the angler that has everything, the traveling angler, or even somebody that's gonna be carrying a couple of rods in a boat, this is an absolutely ballistic rod and reel combo case. Definitely the best we've ever seen on the market. Uh, this thing is uh, obviously waterproof. Um, I believe it's submersible. This might not be a completely waterproof zipper, but um, water's not getting in there as long as you don't let it sink to the bottom of a lake or something. Um, again, the Fish Pond Thunderhead Rod and Reel Case. Again, it's pricey at $199.95, but for somebody that's really looking to protect their rods when they're traveling or out on the water, um, that is a great way to go. And number 10. I'm gonna say this in every episode. Uh, don't forget Matter of Outfitters gift cards. Uh, you can buy them online in a variety of different monetary increments, and we can even email these to you as late as 4 p.m. on Christmas Eve. So, there's a good start, friends. As always, we appreciate you watching. Be sure to subscribe because we're going to have two or three of these episodes here during the holidays coming at you. Uh, we're going to get the staff involved and talk about their favorite gift ideas. So we've got a lot more coming at you. So subscribe, like this video, and please stay tuned. Hey, can I take the sweater off now? I mean, I love it. I, I just think it's more of an outdoor, or maybe it's just the lights, but I think my eyeballs are sweating. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. And check out these videos. We think you might like them too.